Mm, the solar system and his neighbors are all that's left. Why is oh. everyone listening to Usagi? I know. Oh, it's so oh, cute! Yeah. The whole time I yeah. can't handle it! Hey, how's it going? I'm Jenny. Baby here! And today we are on the move closer because <laughs> it's raining, if you couldn't tell. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's downpouring actually. It wasn't yeah. supposed to downpour, but you know, when you live in Florida, it just rains whenever the heck it wants to. Exactly. So anyway, today we are going to be watching more of Sailor Moon Stars. This will be the 16th episode. The last episode yes. we had the data. The data. And look at she's wearing her Sandy Saki shirt. I have just like, well not just, but I have a bunny. She has and her, and and star. So like her blanket, shirt. like her blanket. Yeah, yeah. So fitting. Uh, but yeah, the last episode was really interesting. We had a lot of really fun, cutesy, moody moments, and then we yeah. had some serious moments. And yes. it does seem to appear that Nezu, aka Sailor Iron Mose, is no longer of this world. So it seems like Laxia just does something with these bracelets and then that's all she wrote. Yeah. Uh, which is very interesting and also sad because she was a pretty interesting character. Yeah. We did see these other two characters like about an episode, maybe another episode ago, when they're like one with red hair, one with blue hair, so those are probably like the new coming out to uh, Stassi. Okay. And then with the trailer with the last episode, we also saw what I think a true Stassi looks like. Mm. And then interestingly enough though, Nezu found out the identity of Starfighter, who is oh, Seiya. Yeah. Or rather, Seiya was Starfighter. Yeah. And she was already going after Seiya anyway because she was like... And I'm like, oh, if anyone has a true star seed, it's probably the Starlights. Yeah. And probably Starlight. the, star, yeah. the Sailor Guardians in general as well. Could like, we, we don't know. But... Mm -hmm. And then... She could have given it away because, you know, Sailor Moon was like, where's Seiya? And she's like, oh, you don't know? And then Starfighter does her attack and then stops that from happening. Yeah, and I was <laughs> so excited. You're like, oh, she she's gonna... awesome. Nah, nah, not yet. <sighs> not yet. Who knows when that's going to happen. Yeah. But, yeah. And then Seiya, or Starfighter, rather, seemed to think that maybe Sailor Moon was Usagi because how does Sailor Moon know who Seiya is? Yeah. It's very And then, like, saw, like... An image of yeah. Usagi like yeah. over Sailor Moon and it's like oh, yeah, look, look and similar. the cute little bear brooch. Uh, uh, but then at the end of the episode, it seems like Say is like nah, not possible to be. I want a bear brooch. Yeah, I know it's so cute. It uh, but anyway, this episode looks to be interesting as well. Yeah. We're going to go ahead and see who we know as Chibi Chibi from Cosmos Trailers, mm -hmm. and in the they had talked about like being maybe Usagi's like sister or maybe a kid of hers. We don't know. But that's apparently what's going to happen with this episode. Yeah, so are you she excited? She looks really cute. I'm excited to see it. Yes. Yeah. All right, you all. We're going to go ahead and watch this. If you'd like to watch this season with us from the beginning, we will link the first episode in the cards and the description. Yeah. And here we go. Ooh. Wait. This did we miss one? I'm not sure. Let's see how the stats. Oh no, is she trying to mail to Mamo again? Mm. Her thirtieth letter, and she's been mailing them every day, so it's been a month. Oh my gosh, this girl. Oh, she's so sweet. Oh, wait, hang on, that that happened. Yeah, that happened in the last episode. Yep. Mm -hmm. Aww, Aww. her little sweat drop. <gasps> Why am I thinking about that guy and blushing? Well, yeah. I have a few ideas, but uh. Aww. Aww. Yeah, me too, though. I have a few ideas. <laughs> yeah, right. Says a person wearing a say a new soggy shirt. A butt of course! <laughs> oh my gosh. So I'm thinking. No, 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 no. This is... This seems to be the right episode. Because we saw this in the preview. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Okay, so gotcha. just interestingly, she was talking about that. Okay, yeah. Interesting umbrella style right there. Okay. <gasps> Invaders from outer space. The coming of Siren. Siren. Oh, oh. oh crud. Uh, what do you got there, Galaxia? Oh, those are through star seeds, probably. Oh. There's two of them. So they're gonna work together, or? Dang! 80% of the galaxy? Okay, those are definitely through star seeds. 
Mm, the solar system and his neighbors are all this left. Oh. Oh no. Oh my gosh. This is pretty dismal. Yeah. Okay, so this is Sidon. Why is she so pretty? Ooh. Dang. Oh. Wait, so it's only her who's next. Okay. Okay, the other girl is not. Okay. Interesting. Ooh, pretty. Yeah. Oh, now she's telling them about a Galaxia. Oh, man. I jam. Mm. Oh. Dang it, Haruka. Oh. Where is your Haruka plushie? Yeah, I know. No way. Uh oh. Think back. I think she's gonna think back to her own memories and be like, really? They wouldn't That's help not... her if they were enemies. Yeah. Exactly. Listen to your princess. Oh. Is Marco's pretty high up? Yeah. No! Mina! Oh no. Oh, oh no. no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, 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 oh. Mina, Mina, no. That escalated quickly. <laughs> yeah. Agreed. She's like, oh! Tri Pluto. It's like he's like trusting oh, in her own experience, but the others are implanting. Well, yeah, but that ideas. doesn't mean it's the Starlights, girl. The Galaxia, man. A Galaxia. Mm -hmm. She doesn't know anything about Galaxia, apparently. Hmm. Well, yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Is that her ice cream? She has like... a popsicle. <laughs> yeah, she's so funny. Yeah. But... No, I don't think so. Hmm. Oh, oh, yeah, it's true. What? That's not right. Uh, that's not because she was too trusting. Why is everyone oh. listening to Usagi? I know. Oh. oh, it's pretty. Oh. Uh, oh, there goes the umbrella. Uh, None for you. Why am I having all these feelings? I think it's the music. Yeah, and, the music is very and the emotional. Light coming down mm -hmm. and the. Oh. It's like this whole scene. Yeah. Oh. Oh, it's so cute. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the meow. Her little buns are freaking adorable. Yeah. Ah! <gasps> yeah, that's not surprising. Oh. How do I make my hair into buns like that with little hearts? I don't look up a tutorial. Yeah. If you don't know a tutorial, I'll drop it in the comments, <laughs> please. <laughs> I want to make heart buns. Uh, <laughs> Aww. So cute. Oh, oh. Is that all she says? <laughs> oh, so freaking cute. My heart, though. Mm -hmm. My heart cannot handle this. <laughs> the police box. Uh, where did she oh. go? Uh oh, she's gone. Oh. You looked away for like a second. Where did she. Okay. Right? Oh. Oh, no. oh, oh, Sailor Iron Man. Oh, oh, they made me feel bad for her. Oh my gosh, it's making me hungry. Ah, uh, yeah, that. Oh, that's the other girl. Karasuma. Oh, 
<laughs> She's eating. Oh. <laughs> With the octopus sticking yep. out of her mouth. She's kind of adorable. Why do they keep making them so I cute? I don't know. <laughs> I hope they're uh -huh. not destined for this. Now the mighty have fallen. Oh. 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 <laughs> oh. Oh. Uh oh. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Oh my gosh. What is she doing? More food. Ah! Oh, oh yeah, more food. You called it, babe. She's like. She's like what? Really? Oh, they're looking for chibi. at her makes me happy. Mm. Oh. Mm. Ah. Okay, here we go. Oh, oh shit! A big sister! Oh. This is like a chibi Usa. Uh, yep. Uh. Chibi Usa 2.0. Chibi Chibi! And all she says chibi, is Chibi Chibi. chibi. He's like, she was cute. Now I don't know what to think. <laughs> Isn't that kind of like Pokemon? They always say their own name. They do. That's <laughs> what I can help to think about. I mean, she maybe she'll say other stuff later on, but always right now she just says Chibi. Yeah. And Chibi Chibi. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> oh my I god, love Mina. Her too. <laughs> Is that a kitten? Oh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. she does look like Usagi. She does. Oh. Mm. Oh. Nope. She's oh. like, this is not possible. She just always looks like she's a She's concerned. <laughs> oh. Oh. Look at no. how beautiful she stands, she, like, yeah. elegantly, like, oh. Mm. Mm. I mean, I appreciate Setsuna's, like, concern, but she's not about to attack. Right. Like, Haruka or Uranus. Yeah. <laughs> I even think Uranus would attack Chibi Chibi, to be honest. <laughs> oh, jeez, you think she would attack her? Anything that's not of this planet. That's a ponytail. Is that? It's oh. A... Oh, it's Aya. A weird TV TV. Yeah. Oh, it's so oh, cute. Get in the whole time. I yeah. can't handle it. Oh, yeah. my gosh. Oh. Uh, uh, uh. I want, like, uh, a uh. picture of that freeze frame to put up in my room of, say, like, turning around with right. TV TV. Ah! She even plays for a day. Why does she look so pretty? <laughs> <laughs> Why, <Live. laughs> Yes. Uh, uh, and a little oh, wink. Oh, Chibi likes her. Say a wink so much, like... <laughs> Do oh. say a wink. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she does say other things. She said like that. She copies. Then your younger sister. <laughs> oh. oh! Yeah, 
you do have a few secrets. Oh, uh -huh. say it onto her. Oh. <gasps> Oh, oh, cold out. Yeah, well, that's not untrue. The blushes. Oh, <laughs> what is it about this exchange that's making me so happy? It's, it's just really cute. All too. of it. Uh, all of it. So, are they all police officers for now? Oh, yeah. yeah. They all look freaking adorable. <laughs> Cannot handle. <laughs> Oh, she was Aww, on a break. Oh, she was on break, yeah. <laughs> the real one. <laughs> oh, they're gonna uh, go after the chief of police. If only they went after the one for the day. She's got a. She's they all get so close. I know. And just she's thankfully. eating still. Yeah, that. She's gonna take it away. Uh oh. <gasps> oh, I like Nezu! Oh, oh, oh! Oh, okay. Uh, Usagi so sweet, she thinks about all of yep. her friends. Oh, TV, TV! Mm. Looking after him, like, huh? Yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, is Usagi gonna find them? Oh, she has sunglasses too. Like Nezu. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there's, there's Setsuna. Oh. oh. These are three lights parade. <laughs> they went to the parade to look. Uh -huh. Of course, that's the best place to mm -hmm. really look. It's not because they just oh, wanted to see Oh, she's coming after. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That's that's an interesting way to go about it. Oh my gosh. Uh, right. Katasuma, no. <sighs> oh. Mm. Oh! What? Hi! Mm. Mm. Oh. He's like, I have no idea what she said. Oh! <sighs> oh! Oh! Oh no, does that mean that Pluto's gonna attack to. Oh. Saya sensed it? Yeah. Is what they were showing? Okay. Yeah, she did. Oh my gosh! Oh, that made me hungry. That's so funny. Have dinner. Oh, oh crap. I hope Pluto doesn't attack them. Yeah, too. me too. I kind of find Pluto to be more level headed, but yeah. you never know. She's had to read sometimes. That's true. <laughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> oh! 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 Why is she so she's beautiful? Like a mer she's a mermaid, basically, right? She's a no mermaid. No wonder I like her so much. I like mermaids. Oh! Ooh! She looks so elegant, even yeah. in her attacks. Yeah, she does. Ooh. Dang, Pluto. Yes. Oh, they're on her staff. They moved. They're quick. Uh-uh. <laughs> They're both in there. Okay, so now they have to deal with the beige. Oh! Oh, Robot Cop! Robo Cop! <gasps> oh my gosh! Into. <laughs> oh my gosh, she's right. Uh -huh. I fix my hair with a hang down. Oh, dang! Dang, that police car just got, like, shattered. Or cut in half. Oh! Ooh, oh yes! That... yes! See, she's helping. Helping. On your side. On your side. All of them are there. Oh, it's no. just her. It's just her. 
The others were with her. Oh, oh no, there, 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 there they are. There they are. Oh gosh, please don't attack Pluto. Why are they so cool? Does she know? It's like they're working together. They are. Pluto. They are working together, even though they don't say they are necessarily. Yeah. Well, I feel like Starfighter at the very least wants to help. Yeah. I think the other two are kind of like, eh. Yeah. But I'm really hoping Pluto, after seeing this, will uh -huh. not try to attack. I don't know. Right. Maybe she can like go back and be like, "Hey, Uranus, Neptune, they're not so bad." <laughs> <Unlikely. Yeah. clears throat> <clears throat> I love how they just can't handle the beauty. Oh. 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 For them to say that, oh, this is music huge. Is, this music is uh, sad. Oh. Please don't attack. Please don't attack. They told her she's the only one who can protect the planet. Mm -hmm. That's think, huge, though. It is huge. What is happening? Uh, don't know the Chibi Chibi. Oh, her Ooh, eyes are. She cool. saw all this. Okay. Don't tell me that's where this ends. Yeah, mm. of course that has to end there. Well, at least she didn't attack. Yeah. Aww, Dang, girl. So well. Honestly, this makes me want to cry. It's sad. I know. Oh. Oh dang. Oh, she starts over. Oh, oh! Because she doesn't want to worry him. Maybe. Nope. Apparently not that either. Even that. Oh, because she's nervous about mm -hmm. telling Momo. Aww. Aww. Poor thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, Chibi! <laughs> so cute. Oh, Aww. look at her. Oh. <laughs> Aww. Aww. Oh, it's so cute. <sighs> oh, there you go, man. Yeah, like my shirt. Cute. Aww. <laughs> yes. Aww, and the music. It all is so Aww. cute. Aww. Aww. <sighs> yeah. That. All right, let's see oh what preview. Goodness, really? that was another piece? really intense episode. Here we go. Yeah, a lot happened, as it seems to be lately. Let's see. Oh, sparkly! We get a summer vacation. Yay. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh, Mina, why? Whoa! Oh, little way! Oh my gosh, this is gonna <laughs> sit in my brain. Like the image of Seiya finding Chibi Chibi mm -hmm. and turning around to see Usagi. Like, and the two of them are right there is gonna stay in my <laughs> brain, like, possibly forever. There you go. And, like, in my heart. Aww. It was so sweet. It was really sweet. And mm -hmm. I'm happy that Tatsuna, aka Pluto, also did not end up attacking mm -hmm. uh, the salads because I kind of feel like if you talk about the outer senshi, mm -hmm. obviously you've got Uranus, Neptune. Mm -hmm. Neptune, she sometimes can be a little bit more grounded, so to speak, or whatever. But whenever Uranus, she kind of seems to go with it anyway. I'm trying to think of Hotaru or Saturn, how she would feel about this, since we haven't seen her yet, but mm -hmm. Pluto, at the least, did not try to attack the satellites, which I'm happy about. Mm -hmm. uh, she does seem wary, though, and she also seems wary of Chibi Chibi, which, I mean, yeah. we know. And we also can confirm with Pluto that Chibi Uso is the only child, mm -hmm. so there was no sister or anything like that. Yeah. But overall, this episode was really good. It had a lot of emotion. It did. And we have new enemies now. We yeah. have, uh, well, I think it's more... 
of the one that's more like a mermaid. I think the other one just Siren? hanging out. Siren just Siren? hanging Siren? out. Siren? With, yeah, that's... Mm-hmm. Cordell was just hanging out with her. Okay. For some reason, maybe. She called girl- her her partner. She did. And she got blushy. Maybe they're girlfriends. I don't know. <laughs> but it seems like Alexia really is going to come h- down hard on Siren, too, like she did with Iron Man. So you don't want the enemies to win, but you feel bad for them at the same time. I know. It's so conflicting. <laughs> and I do feel like they're kind of setting that up for future in the future Mm -hmm. like for some of these enemies to be redeemable yeah but in the meantime like they're getting killed off yeah so it's like is one of them gonna get redeemed or some of them yeah it'll be interesting to see but i think that like if you just couldn't stand all of them and you just see them all as bad then there would be no redemption arc for them. Yeah, and I don't really know what the animates are, but apparently that's what Kuro called herself, and apparently that's what Siren was, was an animate. Maybe that's what they are. I don't know. But and I d- Was it animate or animate or something? Animate. So animate or animate, something like that. But yeah, it's yeah. very interesting that she called herself that, too. Yeah. But she's just kind of hanging out and working with Siren, even though Siren seems to be, like, working by herself. Siren's yeah. hilarious with her food. Yeah, she, she has, food. like, octopus hanging I out of her my mouth. Lunch. I have dinner. Like, yeah, failed. she's, like, there on the mission with food in her mouth. They, I love, again, like... A lot of similarity to Usagi, so I think they're showing a yeah. lot of these things like that make you want to like them. You're yeah. like, oh, she's in these yeah. ways like our yeah. main character protagonist that we love. That's true. So yeah, and I think it's on purpose. Yeah, it possibly is on purpose. And then yeah. you know, it's just you have so close yet so far, right? Mm. You don't want Seiya or Yaten or Taiki to possibly lose their star seeds, but at the same time, yeah. it's like if you went for the police officer chief for a day, so close. Even if she had gone after it, there, there's no way she would have because Saya yeah. would have transformed. So there's that's that. That's true. That's true. Um, so it would have been a but, lot harder. But yeah, what was interesting though is that we haven't really seen this, but when we had Saya and we had Plu- uh, Setsuna sensing something was going on, so that was different too. Yeah. We've never really seen that well, it was sort of kind of sense. It, it, we haven't seen something like that, mm-hmm. but we did see at the music show, yeah. Neptune and Saya being like. I feel like something's going on with this person. Yeah. But it wasn't toward an enemy. Yeah. That, so, that's what I thought was pretty interesting. Yeah, And it was only is. her. Yeah. And we had the other two nearby as well. Yeah. So it's pretty interesting. So I'm... This is on a different topic, a different tangent. So I'm definitely seeing these parallels mm-hmm. between Usagi and Mamoru and their, like, origin beginnings of their relationship and their story together. Mm-hmm. And Usagi and Seiya. Mm-hmm. Like, especially now that Chibi Chibi is here. Mm-hmm. So, we see, like, them starting out with, like, this banter. Mm -hmm. Usagi being like, get away from me. Like, Mm -hmm. and then now they're kind of friends or something. Yeah. That Usagi blushes about. Yeah. Like, something. Um, So, they've kind of come around. But also, like, then a little girl coming into the picture and, like, seeing Seiya with Chibi Chibi. Mm -hmm. Like, having similarities to Mamo... With Chibiusa, mm-hmm. like, I'm definitely seeing, like, parallels in kind of the formula of their yeah. story of coming together. It does seem to be like that. Yeah. And then mm-hmm. let's not forget the very beginning of the episode while she was mailing a letter to Mamoru, she was thinking about Saya. Mm-hmm. So anyway. There's a, uh, well, yeah. <laughs> so anyway, here I am with Saya and Usagi shirt. Yeah. I mean, people can ship who they want. I'm they just, can. Usa, Sagi, and Saya, just in my opinion, is really cute ship. So basically, if you don't want to watch them being shipped, maybe don't watch our videos at this point. Like, if you're interested in finding out why people ship them, like, keep on yeah. watching. But if you don't want to hear about it or know about it, like, oh, that's that. It's yeah. really interesting that I heard someone say, because um, I'm in, like, way too many Sailor Moon groups, was that, like, they were okay with... Usagi being shipped with Haruka mm-hmm. because she's not a replacement for Mamoru. But they're not okay with Usagi being shipped with Seiya because Seiya comes in as a replacement a for quote, Mamoru. A quote-unquote replacement. So, I mean, first of all, there is no replacement. There like, isn't. That's the problem I have with this whole entire argument. Uh, I'm like, there is no replacement. Yeah. You have exes, and then you have new people in your life, right? Well, he's not necessarily an ex. He's a person no, who disappeared suddenly. he's gone. Well, he's, yeah. he's, we we know what happened to him. I mean, it's very obvious. Honestly, like, you explained to me what happened. When yeah. I watched it, I didn't realize that he kind of 
disappeared yeah, like that. Yeah, because of the attack with the plane. He's not an ex, but I was, I'm was trying like, to say... But n- because you explained it to me, yeah, then I got it. But it's yeah. not that he's an ex, but it's like, even if he is still in the picture and around or whatever, mm-hmm. Usagi hasn't heard from him, she hasn't seen him. Mm-hmm. Well, she's not seen him, he's supposedly at Medica. Yeah. But it's like, she's allowed to have other feelings for other people. Yeah. She is. And that's yeah. the biggest thing that as a... I, like, ship different ships on different things, too, and even if it's not canon or whatever, I'm like, whatever, I'm still gonna ship it. Yeah. And it gets on my nerves when the true fans of a ship just come after for, like, no reason. They will Mm. bash this character, Mm -hmm. they will make articles, and they'll pick things that they say suit their argument, Mm -hmm. but if they actually watch the episode, they'll know that that's not right, that's not right, that's not right, that's not right. Like, they don't want to see it. They don't want to see it. Which is Mm -hmm. fine! You don't have to see it. But to attack people, and I've seen, like, hardcore, like, Reddit, Tumblr, people's coming at. And, like, we are shipping Say and Usagi, but we can at least acknowledge, like, look at Usagi writing him letters yeah. every day. Look how sad that is. She still definitely has Mamo, like, very present in her yeah, mind. Yeah, she does. And is kind of, like, battling, it seems like, with these feelings of, like, oh my gosh, I'm only supposed to think of Mamo this way, and clearly I'm also thinking of Saya this way. Yeah. And I think, like, part of this argument, it kind of reminds me of people who are, like, well, it's okay for, like, two girls or two women to kiss. Like, that's not cheating, but mm-hmm. it's not okay if you kiss a guy. And then because Seiya is, like, presenting male, um, that it's a whole different thing. Mm-hmm. Um, but I think that that's kind of, like, are you saying that, like, two girls or two women together aren't as legitimate? Mm-hmm. And I think a lot of people don't realize, like, they, they're they upset about the idea of Usagi being interested in someone else, and they don't realize some of the things that they say, like, how it kind of comes across. Like, why is it so different with Seiya from Uranus? Is, like, of course Uranus, we know, already has feelings with Neptune. Like, Haruka Mm -hmm. already has feelings with Michiru. Um, But it's, like, why... I don't understand, like, what this big difference is Mm -hmm. um, that people are talking about, and I think it's because they're not, like, taking someone's feelings as seriously if mm. they are expressing themselves more as a female or as a woman. Yeah. Kind of interesting. It is, it is kind of interesting. Mm-hmm. But, yeah, so it's just, like, ship what you want to ship. Yeah. You know, if it's fine. Yeah. Attacking is not fine. Yeah. And if you don't like something, it's fine. Like, yeah. I'm not a big fan of Mamoru. Mm-hmm. I've made that apparent in some videos. Yeah. But at the end of the day, if you like it, you like it. I'm not going to be like, well, you shouldn't like this ship and this is what. You know, I'm not going to do that. Because... Yeah. It's ridiculous, and mm-hmm. I do agree. There's a lot of hate for Seiya, yeah. and people basically are saying, oh, well, she, he's terrible, or she's terrible, or that's disgusting, that's not okay, that's unacceptable, and I'm like, why? Mm-hmm. Not to mention, right now where we are, she, Usagi has already opened up, mm-hmm. right, to Seiya. She says she hasn't heard from Mamoru. That's the only person who she's told yeah. that she hasn't heard from Mamoru yet, yeah. so it's like, uh... Yeah, she hasn't told like, Haruka to say that she doesn't have, or like, Luna. Some- some kind of deep feelings of trust for her at the yeah. very least is like or even Luna like she yeah. tells Luna pretty much everything yeah. so while she might not tell her like you know her friends she'll be like to Luna mm-hmm. well this is what's going on mm-hmm. right and Luna like well maybe you should tell your friends you know yeah. Uh, so yeah it's just kind of but it's not just this there's other stuff that I watch like within the Ruby fandom there's so much hate right now for Bumblebee because it's now canon yeah. and I love it so much I was there when she watched that <laughs> this is a whole different topic though but yeah, yeah she lost her mind yeah. yeah but it's just like ship what you want to ship yeah let's stop the ship orders because yeah. quite frankly like they're exhausting I will yeah. sometimes just like read stuff and I'm just like man you know say a They'll be, say is this terrible person, she's doing all these terrible things, and I'm watching this, and I'm like, what has she done that so long? Mm. Nothing. Mm. She's been consoling, she's been there, she can sense something's wrong with Usagi, she's trying to get her to open up. She mm. takes her on a date, probably take her mind off of things, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. So, that's not terrible. Mm-hmm. And she's not forcing herself on Usagi either, that's the one I really cannot stand. Yeah. I'm like, when did she force herself on Usagi? I've never seen it. If anything, like, the person who's getting on getting, like, in Us- Usagi's head, which is- isn't what you're saying yeah. is happening, but is Haruka, <laughs> which, like, I love Haruka, but she, like, planted all these really negative seeds, and she planted some kind of fear that you have to, like, be afraid of Seiya, and I think, like, if anything, that made Usagi, like, have more thoughts, she's like, oh, she must be thinking all of these, like, sexy things. And it's, like, not what is thinking at all. Like, oh, she's talking about, like, sexy things. No, she's asking if you want to drink. No, she's saying Taking she wants dance. to dance with you. Like, 
like it's not Seiya, it's Haruka who got in her head. Which is and kind if of funny anything, and like it's clear that like Seiya is like thinking wholesome thoughts and like, oh, I want to make you happy. I want to make you feel better. Yeah, let me cheer you up. Yeah, and it's Usagi who's like with this fear <laughs> implanted, having sexy thoughts about everything <laughs> that Seiya did. So in a way, it kind of backfired. In a way, it backfired. Because sure. now everything is perceived as sexy. Uh, <laughs> or like romantic. Yeah, like, yeah. oh, I'm having these thoughts of her yeah. like holding me yeah. prote- or as him because yeah. she thinks right. Seiya is a he. Um, holding me and protecting me and all yeah. of these things. And that's another thing that I've seen anti Seiya shippers say as an argument. They're like, oh, they can never have biological children because Seiya is actually a woman. And I'm like, so, um, neither can we. Like, you know what I mean? Like, we're married. Like, yeah. I know that this was from the 90s, so couldn't get married. Right. Um, I, I, Definitely in Japan. I don't know what marriage laws are in Japan now. I'm not sure. I don't know. We'd be interested to find out. If you know about it, let us know. Um, We'd be interested to look into it. But back then, like, it wasn't an option, which doesn't mean you can't, like, still live together, promise your life to someone, and Mm -hmm. live as a marriage um, together. Yeah. Um, But, yeah, like... I feel like some of some people just like trying to be very anti say and Usagi are not realizing how like anti two girls slash women in a relationship they're also being. Mm-hmm. So just just leaving that little nugget there. <laughs> Nuggets. <laughs> Any thoughts about that? Yeah, I agree with that for mm-hmm. sure. I mean, yeah. I've definitely seen like like some other fandoms, and there was a person, and she had said like, "You do not realize how bad this sounds, right? Like, you just don't get it." And mm. the person said, "Oh, well, it's not even about that." I'm like, "It's not, mm. because you just made this long paragraph on Tumblr about it, mm-hmm. like a whole thing, and then mm-hmm. it's not about that." Right? And I feel like it's kind of giving the energy of, and not just the energy, the insinuation. That it's okay for Haruka and Michiru to be together because they're side characters, but with a main character, like, who previously had a boyfriend, it's not okay. Yeah. For her to be having romantic feelings to someone. I mean, she doesn't even know she's a woman, but who is a woman? Yeah. So, uh, like, and we were listening to a podcast recently that was talking about how, like, they wanted to see more, um gay characters in, like, shoujo and shonen Mm -hmm. anime, and I was just kind of like, the truth is that, like, because they're, like, kind of kept very separate, the girls love and boys love Mm -hmm. anime is, like, in its own Mm -hmm. genre, Yeah, and I'm kind of like, you know, maybe it's because we don't want to just be side characters all the time, like, maybe we want to read our own stories of two girls being together as the main couple, as the main characters, um... Yeah, because this is a really good example. If you haven't heard of it or seen it, Magical Girl Raising Project, there Mm. is a really cute lesbian couple. Mm. It's a very sad anime, so maybe if you're for the don't like sad stuff, maybe not watch it. But they're really cute, and they show them together, but we don't see much of it. Maybe it's a manga, maybe you more see it. It would be wonderful to have seen the relationship, how they met. I was thinking about that recently. I was thinking about Winter Prison is the one that like looks kind of like you, who's kind of like more boyish. Um, And I was like, you know, she doesn't get much screen time. But I'm wondering if in the manga, if um, if any of you sister know, let Nana us know. Was the other one? Yeah, Nana. Yeah, that's Nana. what I was thinking. Her name was like, yeah, Sister Nana. Yeah, and she looks like a nun. But it's really they're pretty. like amazing. Like they're really cool characters. They're mm-hmm. really cute. Their relationship's really sweet. And we get mm-hmm. you get to see that. Yeah. And it would have been great to see more of it, right? So mm-hmm. while it's great to have you know gay characters in anime, that's like side. It's it's my opinion, like with you. I like to have, if you're having watched a Yuri anime or a girl love anime, it's mm-hmm. just gonna be that. Yeah. There's no yeah. side characters that are like that. They're just the main characters like yeah. that. And w- So we didn't watch this expecting it. Oh, we obviously know it's Sailor Moon. We don't expect yeah. it to be a GL anime. Um, but I'm just saying that, like, there's something to be said for the fact that, like, people are like, yeah, yeah, it's okay. Focus on the two of them, on Haruka and Michiru. And, but Usagi can't be. Like, it's not okay for Usagi um, to be with a woman. Yeah, I do remember girl. when Naoko yeah. came out and said that Usagi was bi, and people were flipping out. Mm. They're like, that's not possible. <laughs> but if you go back and you watch the original anime, and you see her saying, oh, she's pretty. Oh, and she's blushing and stuff like that. So yeah. you can definitely Mako. see it. Like, yeah. Mako and... Uh, we the- were When we were, like, watching Crystal, she says to me, 
why do straight people even watch this? She was, like, joking. It's a joke. Of course we understand. Um, but she was just joking because of how many times Usagi, like, meeting the other girls. With she's Ray. just like, Ray is so pretty. And she's, she's blushing. Like, yeah, like, blushing. <laughs> and then she gets, like, rescued by Mako. And she's just like, oh, her perfume and her earrings. Like, you're so pretty. Yeah. So it's just, like, obviously a straight girl can think this. But it's just, like, very, like, mm, you're obsessing about how pretty these girls are quite a bit there, Usagi. And, of course, yeah. when Naoko came out and said she yeah. was bi, too. So, yeah. it's, it's, like, it was awesome. When my friend was like, did you hear Usagi was bi? Like, we know. Looks up line. Because ah, it's awesome. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, overall, though, Star Wars has been good. Chibi yeah. Chibi's adorable. Yes. And that's... it looks like the next episode, there's, like, kind of, like, kind of like a horror situation going on. It's kind of like... They're going on vacation, and there's, like, a chainsaw, and there's a girl screaming, and then there's some guy with some facial hair trying to give something to maybe Tiny Ray. I have no idea. Yeah. There's a lot going on I'm excited episode. to see it. Some of it looks a little wholesome. Because, like, little the vacation Ray. vibes. Little Ray. Yeah, She's little so Ray. cute. So I'm going to hang on to those little wholesome parts yeah, of it, even not, if it is a little more spooky. Yeah, you're not really one for horror stuff, nah. so. All right, we've talked enough <laughs> for now. <laughs> yeah, but we have so much fun talking about all this stuff. Yes. yes all right you all thanks so much for watching and if you've enjoyed watching this in honor of chibi chibi drop a heart in the comment section below she always makes those faces because she never knows what i'm gonna I say i have no idea yes. she could say anything from it. like that to like a popsicle to like a happy <laughs> face and sunglasses and i'm like what's she gonna say <gasps> oh my gosh yeah we're gonna go with a heart for this time popsicle would have been cute what but... umbrella <laughs> book book is good <laughs> All right. We look forward to connecting with you all again soon. And we will be sending so much love. Till next time. Laters.